Friday, but I was here at the P.O. Box sending out a baseball for a fan of mine. Shout out to the homie Ty. So uh, we're here anyways, figured might as well check the P.O. Box. Let's go. And for those of you that are always asking, it's P.O. Box 3282, Lucky. Las Vegas, New Mexico, 87701. Please don't send anything for Will, only for the... What did I just say, guys? Don't send anything to Will, please. I'm gonna have to send this back. Only packages for Lucky Thrives or the puppies. Lucky Thrives, that's what we like to see right there. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And we got a key, so. All right, keys for box number 86. Oh, big box today. Sorry for being so salty. This is very, very thoughtful and uh, absolutely beautiful. Another beautiful piece for Hoop Dog. That is so cute. Not sure who sent these two, but thank you. Um, that means a lot. Sorry for being salty about it. Franklin, check it out, my guy. Got you some lucky treats. Come here, my little guy. You want a treat? Uh, we're not going anywhere, bud. Come on. We just got back from a trip. Come on. Wish me luck. On the green? On the green? No freaking way. Almost on the green. Did you guys see that? Three skips, hit the rocks, went straight up. There's my drive. This thing is just plugged into the fairway 320 yards away look at that Dang. that's the ball we just drove but i'm happy with it oh that i'm not happy with that's a that's an automatic and i missed an automatic right there so actually every time i make a stupid mistake on the golf course i have to do 10 perfect push-ups Back in training season, guys. I'm gonna lose his sponsor. We're gonna drop. We're actually not gonna drop any weight. We're sitting at 180 right now. And we're gonna put on muscle. We're gonna convert this fat to muscle this year. We're gonna get really good at golf. And we're gonna we're gonna win the state championship in golf this year. Alright. Happy game more coming up. See if I don't make a fool of myself. Whew. 
I don't even know. Should I like gauge my steps? Should I take a practice swing first? Or should I just, ah, you know what? No, I'm just going to send it, guys. It is what it is. It's a feel thing. There's no measurement to the happy. Let's go. Oh, and I smoked it. Oh, shit, guys. I hit the house. Yeah, let's go. I did not think that was going to happen. Alex, I'm sorry, bro. Oh, my God. That was so loud. Did you guys hear the back? From the metal building or whatever I hear? Oh, my God. That was so bad. We, we were never on that part three, okay, guys? We were always playing the par five. Let's just, let's just give it hell. Oh, and I peered it. What a shot. What a, who is this guy? Did I send that to the bunker? No way. That's not even a divot. I just, I just nicked the top of the grass there. Didn't even take a chunk out of it. I hit that so short of the green. Good shot, right on the fairway. That's a good shot right there. That was, so, oh my God, go in. Oh! No freaking way. That's the second pin that we hit today. Second pin. I just knocked the pin. It rolled around the hole and did not go in. Ugh. Alex, did I break your window? I just hit a house, dude. I nailed the house. It was nowhere. It was nowhere. Nowhere near Alex's house. I was just joking about that, but I really did nail some type of building. We hit that pin just a second ago, guys. We hit that pin, almost an eagle chipping, and now we got a we got a knee shaker, a birdie. I just missed the knee shaker right now. Oh, that's good. That's good. I got another package coming for you guys soon. I wanted to send it out with this one, but I just didn't have enough time to prepare what I wanted to send out. Smoked it again. I should just start doing Happy Gilmore for my actual golf swing. My goodness. You guys wanted to know what I do for work? There you go. This entire fume hood is about to get a nice makeover. Got some pretty nasty stuff in here, sulfuric acid, hydrochloric acid, hydrochloric iron nitrate, dichloromethane, more hydrochloric acid, some nitric acid, sulfuric acid. Who knows what's on these walls? Let's get it cleaned up. Keep at it. See how much I can do.
All right, guys, this is what it's looking like right now. 30 minutes in. Starting to make progress. Let's keep going. All right guys, one week into 3D printing, and now we're making full-blown chemical molecules. Look at the detail in this. Look at how many brackets that I had to place in order for this model to print properly. So cool. is sometimes acceptable for you to experiment and attend it, but there are certain precautions that you must take if you expect to do so. Yo, what's up guys? Another Friday, we're here at the post office. Let's see what you guys sent this week. And yes, it's actually Friday this time. I know I checked the box early this week. It's PO Box 3282, Las Vegas, New Mexico, 87701. And it looks like we've got another package. Only one this time. Let's see what we got. All right, guys, since Will's not supposed to get mail at the P.O. Box anymore, he gave me permission to open every package that says Will Survive. And this one does say Will Survive. We're going to see what's inside. I'm actually not going to open this vacuum seal bag. It looks like a custom blanket or something of that sort, probably related to Hoover, and I don't want to get it dirty. You know, I want to keep it nice and compact, so I'm just going to give it to Will as is. Whoever sent this, thank you very much. It has been received. 12 seconds later. Thanks again for this and everything else you guys have sent to the P.O. Box. We really appreciate it. I'm not sure when I'm going to be able to get that to Will because we're going up to Colorado this weekend to see my brother play baseball. But uh, I'll get it to him as soon as possible. And if I don't see you guys up at the cabin, stay happy, stay healthy, stay lucky. And we'll see you here at the post office next Friday. Peace. Downtown Alamosa, Colorado. We just finished eating at the Purple Crew. It was delicious.
delicious. This one's hiding from the camera, being a creep. <laughs> oh no! Andrew's throwing snowballs. You gotta save your arm. You're gonna throw out your arm. Yo, what's up guys? It's Saturday morning, we're outside the hotel here in beautiful Alamos, Colorado. Mountains right behind me here. Headed to my brother's game in about an hour. It's gonna be pitching about three o'clock. I might go live with it, let's see. Hair's a mess, need a haircut. Maybe he will join me up at the cabin tomorrow and uh, give me a haircut up at the cabin. Just rolled up to the baseball field. Let's see what's going on on the other side. Let's go, Drew. After a brutal ass kicking, we got one more stop on the Colorado here. Mikey had to take a picture of the dinosaurs. Here we go. Favorite gas station right here, Sinclair's. Sinclair sponsor me. Dolo fancy in here. Ooh, and they're rocking Dio on the on the radio. Come on now. Come on now. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, that's me right now. I gotta take a mad. <laughs> uh, free pizza guys from Dynaco. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, so I guess I guess I gotta take a bite with some cheese. Cheers. Actually decent. No, it's actually not bad. Headed back from Colorado and we stumbled across this place. It looks crazy here. Let's go check it out. Yo, Zach, can stay for for you. We just hit Taos and uh, decided to stop at this interesting looking building here. The Overland Sheepskin Co. No idea what's inside. What do you think's in here? Sheepskin? Ugly. That's, a, that's a good guess. <laughs> Look at this room. No way. <laughs> I 
I'm too down. <laughs> it's so cool until you realize how many animals went down for this room here. Yeah. Cool. Even looks like Rico. Like really cool. like really cool. <laughs> 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 now I'm wishing we would have left the roof of the cabin metal. It looks pretty cool. Even with the logs. That might even be chinchilla. That's a bunch of little tiny animals made into one big blanket. Oh. How cute. <laughs> hey, Eddie. Oh, nice to meet you, buddy. <laughs> Kennedy is so bougie, she got her jacket from here, guys. <laughs> I mean, how much did you pay, Kennedy? It was, it was, it was only eight ninety five, dollars like, with your Lulu around it, too. Aye, aye. <laughs> bougie. She bought it today. Oh, how much is this? This is like a jacket. This is $8.95, too. That's not bad. All right, while you guys shop, I'm gonna check out the architecture and the engineering of this building. How did they do it? We're building this next, guys. Skylight. Yo, what's up guys? It's Saturday night. We just got back from Colorado and my buddy April just called me and said that he dropped off a box from his mom with some pots and pans and some other goodies. Here it is behind the truck. Oh my God, this thing's heavy. I'm gonna need two hands to put this thing inside so I'll get back with you in a second. We got a package, buddy. We got a package. We gotta open it, come on. Two. Lucky, Lady Lucky, Will and Jesse from the Chavises. This is from Abel's mom, I believe. I think that's what he said. Oh, right off the bat, check out that cast iron. John Wayne, damn, that's, that's some bougie stuff right there. Franklin, we got some stuff for you, buddy. That's right, buddy. That's right, that's right. Oh, I gotta give you a lucky treat. Let's check out let's check out this stuff first and then I'll get you a lucky treat. Oh I know exactly what this is. This is one of those potato peeler things. You load the potato on the spikes and then you spin it around and it peels it. Yeah, yeah. It's it's, it's pretty cool, isn't it? Pretty, pretty cool. And then you can even mount it on the table. Super, super sick. Some more nice cast. Ooh, another John Wayne. Look at that. Is too cool. This one. These are gonna be so nice up at the cabin. I bet this is. Uh, it sure is. Dang, these are like brand new too. Thank you so much. Most definitely will be used and loved by us, just like this pan has been. Last thing in the box is this really, oh, this is a cast iron muffin pan. Very, very cool. All we need now is a cast iron cooking stove. What you think, buddy? <laughs> Give me that paw. Give me that paw. Give me that paw.
All right, as promised, before I end this video, a lucky treat for Franklin. You ready? You ready for a treat? Come here. You know what you gotta do. You gotta sit. Oh, this is a good boy. Ah, sit. Come here, Pop. Good boy, you got it down. You got it down. There you go, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. Come oh, on, where are you going? Oh, he loves the heater. That's a good boy. How's that treat, my guy? Is that good? My goodness. Squid, come here. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Oh, I got your treat. I got your treat. Oh, oh he got it from me. He's like, no, not today. Not today. All right, come here. Sit. Good boy. That's a good boy. Go get it. Go get it. What do you think? You like it? That's a good boy. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Give me paw. Good boy. Good boy. Man, you're learning so fast, dude. You're so smart. What's up, Lucky Fam? It's Sunday morning. We're about to head up to the cabin, but not before we grab Beluga and Leia. Both of those puppers are going up with us today. It's gonna be so much fun. I'm ending this video here and including the rest of this footage from this point on over on day 42. So we'll see you guys over there. Um, I'm gonna be posting this video today, sometime in the evening, probably while we're up at the cabin still. So I'm gonna try and catch a premiere with you guys live at the cabin. It's gonna be tons of fun. Thank you, thank you so much for watching the videos, supporting the page, and spending the week with me. Now you guys get to see what I do on the daily. It's a lot of fun. I'm a busy, busy guy. And now you guys get to see why I can't spend every single day up at the cabin. I would if I could, but I got a busy life and there's a lot of things that I don't really want to sacrifice right now to go up to the cabin. But in the future, that may change. And I may be willing to drop a lot of things in my life, like my job and stuff like that, to spend more time up at the cabin. So. We'll see where this journey takes us, guys. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen in the next couple months? But I'm here for it. You guys are here for it. And uh, we're going to have a really fun time doing it. So, you guys, thanks once again. Stay happy. Stay healthy. Stay lucky. And we'll see you up at the cabin today. Peace. How is that so freaking heavy? <laughs>